Fowler, KTMYNaturalHappiness.com, creator of the Seeds of Change program to help you go from Hamps to to Happiness, founder of Reading School of Reiki. How are you? Sending you a massive hug. How are you feeling about the easing of lockdown? Everyone seems to be at a different level and it can be hard uh, to understand other people's side of things. Everybody's doing the best they can and it's kindness and love in our souls. So sending you a massive hug, sending you a massive hug. As always, I pulled out a card for you for watching the video. And oh my goodness me, so perfect, so perfect. I'm grinning like a Cheshire cat at this card. Even though I felt some resistance around it, I will be honest, I felt resistance. Hunter, track down your fears and your desires. Track down all of your fearful thoughts and feelings. When you find them, you will find your desires too. So perfect, so perfect. It's so perfect because this is what um, the Seeds of Change is about, it, the Seeds of Change program that I, I offer to help people achieve their dreams, wishes and goals. And it's about tracking down what's stopping you and tracking down, you know, working out what it is that's held you back from doing it so far what's got in the way and are those stories real or not real and, um, and and just working through if they're real okay let's look at it and if they're not real let's work on a way to sort it out so that you can achieve your dream and you can get to where you want to be and it's a constant evolving process and it's something that you know it's like a layer of an onion every time I think I've kind of sussed it there's another layer that seems to appear uh, and, and it's a, a lifelong process. It's a lifelong process, which you know is means that it's, oh, it just helps us be a little bit happier along the way, which is my natural happiness. Um, yeah, so it's really interesting. It's it's so perfect. I've just been helping a client do that um, so beautifully around her business because she wanted to work out why it was that she. Uh, no matter what she did, she didn't seem to see the results, and it worked out. We worked out it was a fear, a, a deep-based fear of actually being uh, able to receive. And it was one of those where once we worked on it, all of a sudden her business shifted. And so many, and you know, in so many different instances, that's unlocked in so many different dreams. Uh, it's how I created this business. It's how I got my holiday cottage. So many different things. So, and I'm grinning because I've been working on this. So track down all of your fearful thoughts and feelings and when you find them, you will find your desires too. Clear the path and make it easy. Make it easy. Oh, anyway, it is, it is possible. So, the Hunter card is based on my favourite, this is Carl Gray, uh, my favourite Celtic god, Cananus. He is the stag god of the wild. And represents both the hunted and the hunter. Similarly, the hunter helps you connect with an energy that is both fearful and fearless. Your fears are the only things that are standing between you and what you desire at this time. So you have to come face to face with them, as the hunter does with wild animals, and then go beyond them. The extended message, instead of being hunted down by your fears or other feelings that you may have buried, become the hunter. You are being given confidence and strength at this time, so you use your power to make a difference in this world. You are not here to cower away. You are not here to live in the shadows. You are here to realise your fullest potential. But this can only occur when you step up and do what needs to be done. When this card arises, there could be an opportunity to face an aspect of your past or bring closure to a situation that has been haunting you. How many of us have things from our past that have haunted us until we clear them? Move, get, get them out of the way so we can move forwards with love and kindness in our heart how many of us I know I, I've had to work on a few things so 
Um, lead by example. <laughs> so if you are a man or identify as male, this card represents your masculinity and an opportunity to know yourself more deeply. If you are a female or identify as a female, this card represents your capacity to be strong and powerful and overcome limitations. Just beautiful, just beautiful. And, you know, it's what we work with. And funnily enough, I'm actually working with this, this sort of thing with an, a client at the moment about in a different scenario. And, um, you know, when we work on our own stuff, we can create magic and... You know, it really does. It really does help you clear the way so that you can achieve your dreams, wishes and goals. That's what the Seeds of Change program is about. It's magical and it's wonderful and it's utterly fabulous. I'm so blessed with the people that come through and the results they get is incredible. So um, that's our card. That's your card for the week for watching the video. Track down your fears and your desires. Track them down. Um, when you when you clear the path it can be easy it can feel sometimes when you haven't been clearing the way it can feel like you're constantly swimming upstream and you're constantly battling and when you start tracking down the fears and work and working through those you suddenly start realizing that you're you're going with the flow and just things come to you that you've been dreaming of for so long and it's magical it really is it really is it's it's an incredible shift, and if you want any help in doing that, that's what I do. If you've got stuff from your past that's really been affecting your present or your future, please contact me. Please contact me, because there's things that we can do to help you track down your fears and, and, achieve, and your desires and ah, achieve your dreams, wishes and goals. So Friday, 5pm, last ever... Um, jumping there but just to let a few housekeeping um for last ever uh, pay what you want virtual retreat and uh, because lockdown is easing it's time for me to put a boundary around that offering that i've been offering in lockdown so it's the last chance to come on a pay what you want basis um i'm sure i'll be running other virtual retreats along the way but this is where you can pay what you want to pay so it's the last opportunity to work with me on that basis and uh, so if you're interested head to the my natural happiness facebook page and you will see a link um, to the zoom call and paypal link so you can just pay what you want to pay and then i'm sure i'll be running other virtual retreats excuse me <coughs> I'm sure I've been running other virtual retreats in time um, because that's what I do and they've been beautiful and this is the last one where you get to pay what you want rather than full rate which is where we'd be going going forwards setting boundaries uh, one of the things I help people do on the Seeds of Change program set their boundaries so uh, sending you so much love enjoy coming out of the lockdown at the level that you feel comfortable at enjoy so much oh excuse me <coughs> i clearly haven't had enough brews this morning oh that's better one has got to have a fat of tea on the go so sending you so much love surrounding you in so many so many hugs if you want to step into them and if any of this speaks to you, drop me an email on kate at mynaturalhappiness.com and we can have a chat. It's no obligation, there never is. If it's right, it's right. If it's not, it's not. It's cool. So sending you love with so much love, kate mynaturalhappiness.com, creator of the Seeds of Change program to help you go from hamster to happiness, founder of Reading School of Reiki. Have the most amazing week. Lots of love. Take care.